What's up guys and girls? So I am super stoked to be back again doing videos. I haven't done one in quite a while because I've been away. So I downloaded the Nuka Nuka World in the Fallout DLC and got cracking on this. So I'm going to be pumping out guides all weekend on this particular DLC. So first up we have is the Nuka Cade arcade games. Now some of these you can cheat, some of these you can do them properly, but the aim is to get the most tickets as you can. So first up is the Nuka Zappa race. Now obviously the aim is to get the highest score possible, but you don't have to, you'll still get tickets for whatever you get. So first off, slot in your token and start going to town on the target under the one that you put the token in. And as you can see, it just goes up and you've got to get to the top first and you get a bit of extra score if you do that. Once you smash that out, not quite sure why I was shooting at the target, but once you smash that up, grab the tickets there at the dispenser and head on over to the next one. So next up is the banded roundup, and this is kind of like that old duck shooting game back in the day. So change your weapon to anything else aside from the squirter and just shoot the targets as they scroll across. Simple enough. And they will get faster as it goes along, but you shouldn't have too much of a problem with this. I mean, also you could jump the counter and just shoot them point blank if you want, or shoot one rocket launcher into as many as you like and it'll take them all out. So there's many ways of doing it, many ways to get tickets fast, but just do what you like to do. Now this Wacker combo is quite difficult actually when I started it out. I couldn't quite figure out how I could hit fast enough to, to connect them. But this machine over here has the lowest high score. So take out your knife if you want to, anything with a high hit rate, and start whacking them. Now I do show a different method which is way easier after this little round and you will see why in a second. Now with all of these games, you, there's always a way to cheat. So with this one, it was pretty obvious. I've got a weapon there with explosive bullets and I just shot one off every time I saw one and it'll take out two or three, however many are up. Now obviously if I stood further away from the machine, I wouldn't be getting damaged every time I shot, but clearly I wasn't focused on that. So in the end, this was just very easy. Just take out a weapon and shoot them as they pop. So next up we have the hoop shot. Now again, if you want to do it properly, just hold down square on PS4 at least and the longer you hold it down, the further you'll throw it. Or you could just walk up and well, you know, do that. So if you want tickets fast, there's always ways to do it and to beat the high scores obviously. So you'll smash this one out pretty quickly and we'll head on over to the next one.
Next up, there's the atomic rollers. Now again, if you want to do it properly, hold down square. The longer you hold it down, the further it'll, it'll go and so on. But obviously, if you want to do this quickly and get your tickets, just pick it up and drop it in the hole that you want it to go into. And the ones on the top left, I think, and top left and top right at least, are the highest scorers. But this goes on for quite a while, so you'll be able to get this one fairly easily. So once you've done this one, we can head on over to the ticket redeemer and collect the prizes of your choice. So this is what the machine looks like that you can re redeem your tickets. Um, it takes a little while to activate actually, you click and then you wait a bit, but when it does go inside there's level prizes you can choose from and obviously the higher level the better. So redeem your tickets and then you can actually spend them. So the ones that are most noticeable in here would have to be the acid squirter which is about 6200 tickets and the paddle ball which was actually quite amusing and I know that both the weapons get actually pretty hardcore at the late stage of this and I'm super amped to do guides on that later. So in this bird, I think I purchased the paddle ball. Yeah. And once you've done that, you can exit and go collect it at the, at the dispenser which is actually located behind the machine. So there it is. Good old fashioned paddle ball. Can't wait to see the, the mods that are going to be attached to this puppy. So with that, it's going to bring us to the end of the video. I hope you find it informative, and if you're looking for more, I'm going to be pumping out guides on this Nuka Cola DLC all week and weekend. So with that, have a good one, and I'll see you next time.